Hello everyone, welcome back to another video. My name is Kwame and if you're new here, I like to take pictures and I like to help you take better pictures. So today I'm going to share with you my updated everyday carry kit. What kind of everyday carry? I'm going to show you what I do carry every day with me and then what sometimes comes with me and then what I carry it in. So let's talk about uh, what I take with me every day, pretty much everywhere I go. That is my new phone. That it, that is the iPhone 14 Pro. So this is the, the latest iPhone uh, as of this recording. And I just picked it up uh, at the end of February, middle of February as a self birthday gift, kinda. Uh, but a really cool phone. I have the iPhone 7 Plus. So this is what I was upgrading from. Um, fun fact, I still use this phone as uh, my actual phone and I use, just use this as a camera right now. And I'll talk about that probably in a later video. But I have been absolutely enjoying this phone. Uh, and this phone is the reason why this whole setup has changed. Um, so, I mean, I'm not going to go over the specs. You all know the iPhone 48 megapixel main camera, uh, wide angle camera and a telephoto camera. And the reason why I picked this up is because, again, this was old and I was getting bullied by my friends and family. And I have to say, I'm absolutely in love with this uh, phone and, and this camera. And it kind of really fit a need that I was having. And I'll talk about that here at the, towards the end. But this is the phone that I use. I take all my pictures with this phone. I don't shoot raw uh, too much with this picture because 48 megapixels uh, raw image is quite a bit. And so I, I usually just shoot JPEG on here, but it looks absolutely amazing. I love using the wide angle uh, camera. However, I've been using this mainly for video. And so I've been taking a ton of videos using it on the channel. I don't know if you've noticed, but I use um, this, the video on here on the channel now a, a lot. So I really do like this camera on the, on the phone. And so I've been using it and take, taking pictures with it every single day. Next camera is my trusty Rico GR3X. And this is a 40 megapixel, 40 a millimeter lens uh, equivalent camera with a 24 megapixel APS-C sensor. And the combination between these two cameras, I'm calling them camera. Uh, and it's really not just one camera with these three cameras and this, uh, this camera is really amazing. You know, I'm able to get really wide angle, punch in and get a telephoto zoom and then regular pictures. But then when I really want to just, you know, just take my normal walk around pictures, I use the Ricoh GR3X because the 40 millimeter lens is something that I've actually gotten quite used to and absolutely love that look. And also you can do close up photography with this. It's not macro photography, but it's close up photography. You can do macro photography with this one. Yeah, this one looks okay macro photography wise, but then when you see this camera and the close up photography you can do, it's just unbelievable. So these two cameras, I can get 90% of the shots that I want to get with uh, these, just these two cameras and I absolutely love it. Next, uh, I bring AirPods with me everywhere I go. And you may say, how is this part of photography? When I'm out walking, uh, walking around like at the Bellevue Gardens or something, I don't want to be bothered. So I throw in some headphones and I can just zone out, listen to a podcast or just listening to music, or I just put them in, not listening to anything and people just leave me alone. <laughs> Uh, battery pack because if you're taking pictures and video all day with your phone you're gonna want a battery pack what's awesome with the newer iPhones MagSafe which is new to me uh, so being able to use this wirelessly to charge my phone is pretty great this Belkin uh, battery here is okay for the iPhone 14 Pro if you have like the 12 13 14 regular or the minis uh, you can easily uh, charge your battery to full, I believe, with this camera, with this battery. With this one, I can charge it from zero to 75%. I've never had to do that, but I can if I need to in a pinch. Uh, so I do bring this with me. And then also I bring with me is this SD card reader because yes, the Ricoh GR3X and other Ricoh cameras have wireless, but it takes a little while to do it. It's not terribly slow, but uh, having the card reader is much easier. So I bring this everywhere. So these five pieces of gear always go with me everywhere I go. Typically, like I'll just throw these in my pocket, but if I'm going out, you know, I'll put everything in a bag. Uh, but yes, this always goes with me. Uh, unless I'm going like on a short, like just pick up the groceries and I won't bring the, uh, the battery pack or even the SD card. Sometimes I'll just bring these two because if I do want to 
quickly uh, put over, send over a picture to the phone. I can do that pretty quick. Now, what does come with me every now and again, or if we're, I know we're going out someplace and I want to take uh, pictures, are these two pieces of gear, or these three. So these are all three separate pieces of gear. So this is a, um, a clamp that I picked up off of Amazon. Everything I picked up off of Amazon, and I will share uh, those links down below. And this is a little um, plastic ball head system. And I got it from another uh, setup, and I will, again, we'll leave that. I'm going to actually have a video on that set, set up here uh, later on the channel. But this here lets me mount my phone or camera to pretty much anything. So instead of bringing like a little tripod with me, like I used to bring, I bring this here and then I can, I'm going to use the iPhone in, as an example. I, I tighten this down. I can loosen this, uh, this little lever up here. And now I have, I can angle the, the, in this case, the iPhone, however I want. And this clamp can clamp onto pretty much anything. What's awesome about this is if I'm in a place where I can't bring a tripod or I don't want to carry a tripod, if I have something like a fence or a, a bar or even a tree high enough up, I can clamp this on there, put my phone in this case, or uh, screw it into the quarter 20 of my Ricoh GR3X. And now I can get long exposure pictures. I can do um, group pictures. I can do cell pictures. And it's a really nice way and you know, really compact way of being able to do that. And I just absolutely love the look of, uh, I just love the, the, the functionality of this, uh, I guess, mobile tripod or mobile monopod rig, I guess. I don't know what you'd call it. And then what's even better is if I need a little extra reach if I'm doing like a group picture or selfie picture, I can just use this to stick my arm out just a little bit further and take that picture. So it's really nice. And again, if I want to take this off, I don't want to, oh, and this, I'm sorry, this is a, uh, uh, just a third party uh, uh, MagSafe adapter I picked up for the iPhone. Again, you can use it um, with the newer iPhones, any ones that have MagSafe in them. I don't know all of them that do. If I want to put this on my Ricoh GR3X, I can put it on here, screw it in real quick. And well, it's not real quick, but I can screw it in. It doesn't take long. Like, look, I'm doing it in real time, screwing it in. And now I can clamp the Ricoh GR3X. And so if I wanted to get, let's say I need to do like a one or two second exposure picture, I can clamp this down, set the self timer, take the picture. Or if I want to do a group picture, again, set the self timer and take the group picture. And having this little contraption is really functional. Um, again, I will leave the link down below, but, and it doesn't cost a lot. I think. So the kit that this came with, so this piece here came with a kit, which I'll show again, like another video. I think that was like $50, but you're getting this, uh, a base that you can put on like to do macro pictures and um, uh, a couple extension tubes. So it's actually a really nice kit for $50. And then these little clips here are, you can pick them up. You know, I have a bunch of little magic arms I get. I, 10 20 dollars uh, you'll get the the, the clamp it's, they call it a super clamp uh, so you'll get the clamp you don't have to pay 90 dollars for like the manfrotto one since it's just a small camera rig but then all this just fits in my bag so let me show you the bag all right so you guys know the bag this is my uh, pgy tech bag and i'm going to show you how this looks so this is the inside as always and so first goes in the uh rico gr3x that so just sits down in there and uh the battery earbuds will go into this one and then a phone it usually goes in my pocket and this will just slip back here this uh the the holder for my phone slips over there and then this one i just get it down as small as it can go so usually i'll just do something like this like fold it over on itself and then that will just sit right down in there like so and then you just zip everything up and boom, you're good to go. And again, I have a memory reader for my uh, camera, my camera, and a little um, super clamp mount that I can put pretty much anywhere to take long exposure pictures, uh, group pictures, anything like that. Again, it's really handy. 
and all this fits in a little bag. You can even get a bigger bag if you want to bring like an iPad mini. Uh, you could do that. You could swap out this kit. The nice part with this kit is, and uh, this bag, you can also swap out things. So right now I'm using the DJI Osmo Action, so, but I could put that over here if I wanted to, then have the Action, this camera, Ricoh GR3X, my iPhone, that's in my pocket, and then this kit here. And again, this will uh, work with the uh, DJI Osmo Action, just unscrew it and screw it into the, to a quarter 20 mount on the Action, and you could use it that way too. You could get uh, some Arca Swiss releases and put them on to this uh, little rig, and you could easily do it that way. So there's a ton of ways that you can accessorize this kit. And I will, again, have everything all linked down below. I will even leave a link to my Amazon page. You don't have to buy it from there, but it's just a nice way to um, have everything organized in one um, mobile photography kit. That's what I'm calling it. And again, it's just not because it's a phone, but because it's mobile and it's photography. So it's my mobile photography kit. Let me know down in the comments below, what is your guys' uh, mobile photography kit? What do you carry your stuff in? What do you bring with you on a daily basis? What do you bring with you on like on a semi-daily basis? Like I said before, on a daily basis, the, the phone and the camera always go with me uh, along with the AirPods. So these will always be in my pocket no matter where I'm going, grocery store, to uh, go on for a quick walk picking up my kid from school, wherever. These three are always with me. And then if I'm really being ambitious, I will bring the whole pack and um, bring the little little rig here so I can take pictures and all that good stuff. Thank you as always for watching this video. If you wanna see uh, pictures from this setup, I will have a link down below to my website where you can see those pictures. Also, let me know if you have any questions, leave them a uh, link down below in the comments. I will get back to you as fast as I can. I will see you in the next one. Talk to you later, bye-bye.